Hey YouTube, this is Matt7Games here. Thank you so much for checking in and watching. And in today's episode, we will be doing another vintage pack opening. So this is episode two of my mini series for vintage booster pack openings. If you missed my first video, I opened up a jungle booster pack. Check out the link at the top if you missed that, and then come back and watch this. So in today's video, we will be opening one of my favorite booster packs. It is none other, let me center that there, than the Fossil Booster Pack from 1999. Oh my, how I loved opening these as kids. Uh, some of my favorite cards from this series was definitely Zapdos, as depicted on the cover of this. Uh, I also liked, I'd say Lapras was probably one of my favorites as well. Um, Aerodactyl was cool. And Kabuto, uh, or Kabutops, excuse me. So as far as the foil cards, uh, I would love to pull any of those. And of course, Magneton was cool as well. So I'm going to take my time on this and let you guys take a look. Okay, I got these on eBay. So again, if you watched my first video, I'm hoping to pull a hollow. Really hoping that the seller did not weigh these. So we'll take a look. Here is the Wizards of the Coast print. Everybody's favorite Pokemon card company. And I'll let you get a sneak peek of what's on the back here. Can you dig up all the fossil cards? Let's see here. Oh, we're gonna peel this back here. I'm gonna be very careful when I open this too. I'll let you take a look at all the stuff down here. Questions? No, who knows? So again, Wizard of the Coast, Nintendo, and Expert Level. Okay, so I guess that's enough uh, looking at the package. Let's open it up. Let's see what we get. I don't know the trick for the card trick, rather. Um, I believe it's three from the back, but I usually do two just to be safe. Okay, we're going to be so careful with this. I want to save... The Zapdos cover. I might be able to. Oh, I might be able to get this open from the top. All right. Nice. Awesome. So you collectors won't have to cringe. Oh, we'll do it this way. Okay, there are the cards, guys. We'll set the pack down here, and we will do two from the back. Cards seem to be in decent condition. Okay, so let's get into the pack opening position here. Okay, so we got a Graveler to start. I'm really going to take my time with these so you can check out the artwork. I love that. Looks like it was drawn with a uh, color pencil. We got a Gold Duck. We got an Energy Search. I believe there's four energies in this series. I'll have to check. We got a Psyduck. We got Ekans. I feel like Ekans is in almost every pack. <laughs> Geodude. Oh, wow, he's coming right at you. Love the artwork on that. We got an Ammonite. This was one of my favorite cards. I love the artwork there. We got a Gambler Trainer. I don't think there's any energies in this. We got a Grimer just hanging out near a, looks like an oil uh, can there. And we got a Haunter. Is that our rare? I think that's our rare, guys. So we got a Haunter as our rare. I have this card, of course, a few of these, and I also have it in a hollow. So we didn't pull the hollow. Uh, not a surprise since I did get these off eBay, but again, we'll see what happens in the next series. And then we end up with a Seedra. So. That's a good pull right there, uncommon. So guys, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely like this video and comment below. Let me know which favorite fossil Pokemon was yours. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of these vintage pack openings and uh, other pack openings that I do. So thank you so much guys for watching and stay tuned for the next episode. This is Matt7Games. Take care.